What's up guys, DJ back again with another video. Today, we're announcing the 500 subscriber giveaway. <sighs> About time, huh? <laughs> it's been busy guys, I know. Um, a lot of things to talk about, a lot of things that's been going on, work and all that. So, yeah, finally, I'm going to announce how you can win the giveaway and what's up for giveaway. Uh, I've also got a few announcements to make, channel updates and stuff, you know how it is. And we also have some Booster Pack art sets to show because you all know that I collect Booster Pack art sets. And I always show them to you, give you guys the latest, you know... The latest and greatest Poke Electro kind of, um, you know, updates and stuff. So, yeah. Let's get into this video and I hope you like it. Blah, blah, blah. Let's get into it. Alright guys, we're going to start off with some updates, channel updates. So, alright, what, what's first? Uh, the Poke Electro videos that I've been doing as of late... I'm gonna call it an end. <laughs> I, I made maybe two or three episodes and um, I don't think they get much uh, attention and I don't think people are interested in it so it's all good I understand and um, you know I don't mind doing you know cancelling that show. <laughs> um, in other words I've also you know update uh, I've updated a few of my collections already as well in saying that, so I don't really need to show it to you guys anymore. Um, another reason was because I am in the works, I'm in the middle of buying cards of somebody. Uh, the person you met in the video, his name's Michael. So uh, I needed to update most of my vintage stuff so I can send it to him and then I could possibly buy it. So this actually works out quicker for me, quicker for you guys as well. Room for other content, uh, so it's no big deal that it's uh, it's not going to continue. I might bring it back for the modern sets, maybe, I'm not sure, but yeah. So that's the first news of updates or whatever. Uh, the next one is Jesse videos. So I'm hearing you guys like it. I like it myself, Jesse likes it. So we're going to keep that ball rolling. Um, I I'm liking that format of the podcast style where we're talking back and forth. I might be doing that with a few other different guys as well, some other collectors. So if you do want to show off your collection, feel free to you know let me know and um, we can discuss it. Uh, I plan on making some more videos with Michael as well. He is a hardcore collector, um, as you can see from his base set booster box and a few other stuff that he had. Um, so we're going to make some more videos with him as well. Uh, I might make some videos with TCG Authority. Uh, possibly Electric Type 88, uh, we, we're all kind of you know, across the world and stuff so it can be a little bit tricky but uh, I'm in contact with both of them as always so there is a good chance that I'll have a discussion with them through the same format, um, more so with TCG Authority, uh, nothing's you know set in stone but it's, it's a good possibility. Uh, what else to tell you guys? Champions Path, of course, I have you know plenty in my mind <laughs> uh, I am gonna share my thoughts about it it might be an unpopular opinion uh, I like to be a little bit different from the you know from everyone else and I think it's good to have variety so it's not everyone saying "Ooh, this is uh, boo, 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 this is gonna be great and stuff um, yeah I'm gonna look at that a bit objectively and also you know probably make a video with a Jesse about that as well so look out for that one that's going to come soon um, because we don't want to miss out the hype train uh, what else that's it let's get into you know looking at some stuff some boost packs and also you know what's up for grabs for the giveaway alrighty guys so welcome back as usual uh, what's up for grabs for this giveaway 500 subscribers is a blister pack art set for Darkness Ablaze. I thought it'd be kind of fitting. Um, I haven't got anything Champions Path yet, so this is... I've shown this before, I, I was going to open it up for a battle, but I've decided not to. I've decided to give it away to you guys instead. Uh, and because I'm showing Booster Pack art sets in here, I might as well give away some sort of Booster Pack art set. This is a Blister Pack art set, Darkness Ablaze, of course, the technically the latest set. Um, not 
that everyone's talking about it. Everyone's talking about Vivid Voltage and Champion's Bath. But uh, yeah, this is up for grabs. All you need to do is like the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and comment in the comment section below what is your favorite booster pack in this video. Uh, not necessarily art set, just the actual pack because it's a little bit of a different art set or I've got two art sets to show. One of them is uh, not your usual art set. So yeah, that's how you win the giveaway. Um, well, not really. That's how you enter the giveaway. And if, uh, what will I do? I'll do a random generator as per usual on this video to see who wins the giveaway. Then I'll send this out to whoever wins. So good luck to all. That's how you enter. Like, comment, subscribe. The comment is your favorite booster pack. And probably tell me why. I'd, I'd be keen to know why you chose that boost back. All right, uh, what else? I have this, guys, Rebel Clash booster box. Um, why do I have this? Because this is your giveaway, or this is what I'm giving away at a thousand subscribers. Uh, I did announce this video ages ago. Uh, obviously, it's taken a while. Uh, at the time of making that video, I wasn't sure how long it would take to hit a thousand subscribers. But um, when we do hit a thousand subscribers, this is meant to go to one of you guys. And I announced this just before this came out. So I was like, ooh, maybe, you know, here's a booster box, the latest set that was coming out, um, Rebel Clash. So <laughs> it doesn't seem like the latest set anymore, but it's still up for grabs. This will be given away at a thousand subscribers. So uh, yeah, if you didn't know that, well, now you do. <laughs> so this is the 1,000 subscriber giveaway um, when we hit that milestone. Cool. Now let's go for some booster pack art sets and you know how I like to do it. Give a bit of history. I got my other phone here with the Pokemon case on it. <laughs> I'm gonna use this for Pokelector. So I'll get into that and show you the art set. Alrighty guys, so first booster pack art set is Plasma Storm, very nice. Uh, I've held back on showing this uh, because I was missing out on one booster pack and it was this one, Articuno. Really cool. I uh, bought this from a trusted seller on Facebook. Uh, the other ones I also bought from a trusted seller on Facebook, but I bought the three of them together. Um, if you ask me, it's going to be between Lugia and Articuno out of these four packs um, in regards to artwork. But we all know Plasma Storm, black and white, it's probably the best, uh, arguably the best set in black and white because of the Charizard. Um, and we're going to take a look at that set because that's how I like to do a thing on the tunnel. <laughs> so that's what the art set is. I can't remember how much I paid, but the I remember I paid like a hundred bucks just for this one. Maybe less, maybe 80, 80 to 100 dollars. And the three of these were quite cheap when I bought them. Uh, maybe like 150. Now I'm just throwing out numbers there to be honest, but I might have it up on the screen if I can find who I bought it from. It was a little while ago. Um, but yeah, I've been busy with other videos. So let me get out Pokelector and let's take a look at Plasma Storm. So this came out. 2013, seven years ago, standard for black and white. Three secret rares, um, 135 cards in the set. And you know, we gotta show some love to some of these other cards because you know what, I always show the chase cards on the screen, which I normally do. Um, sorry if my hand's in the way. I want you guys to see some of the artwork um, and for myself as well, look at that Moltres. Um, Nothing too rare yet. Obviously, these are sets, set cards. Ooh, that Squirtle's cool. And then you got that Articuno EX. Check out how the EX design was. You know how the the design of the bird is outside of the box? It's kind of like the gold stars. That's how EXs were. I kind of miss that. Um, I don't know. It's all right. Like, But check out this as well, the, the P in the middle of the thing, standing for plasma, I think. Uh, Magna Zone, then you got Legendary Birds, pretty standard artwork. Where is that Charizard that we all know is in this set? Lucario, that's uh, TCG's boy. Um, 
Looking, 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 looking. What's cooking? Good looking. Ooh, that Lugia. Really cool. Uh, I mean, it's not valuable or anything, but I'm just looking at the artwork, to be honest. Um, all right. Some full arts there. Eh, they're all right. And there's that Charizard. There's this three secret rare. So you got Charizard, Blastoise, and random receiver. <laughs> what a random card to be a secret um, rare. Let's take a look at the Charizard for you guys. There you go. Really cool. It's like a shiny Charizard. <laughs> look at the prices on that. Um, don't know how accurate those are, but that's the Charizard. Take a look at Blastoise though. He gets he always gets slept on, you know. What they should do is make a set with, like, you know, the starters. You know how they have, they do a lot of sets with Charizard? They should just make a set based on Blastoise or a set just based on Venusaur. I reckon that'll be cool. Um, <laughs> the price difference is so dramatic. 45 bucks according to this, and the Charizard's like $500. Uh, all right. So that is Plasma Blast. There is the random receiver if you wanted to see it. <laughs> 10 bucks. All right. So, Plasma Boss, uh, Plasma Boss. Um, this is the last art set I'm going to show you guys. It is quite an interesting one that I've been chasing for a while. Do you recognize the back of these? Why are they so different? And why is there more than four? Well, you guessed it, guys, because it is the Pop Series, Organized Play. And um, so, these are quite interesting. This is why I said, you know, as part of the giveaway for the 500 subscribers to pick your favorite booster pack because it might not be your plasma storm packs but it might be one of these designs on the series so we got a blaziken to start off with we have a venusaur we got a you know the three dogs that might be this was actually the most expensive one that i paid for i don't know why and you know wouldn't take a look at the cards in a sec because they're quite interesting. They're all they got small sets. I think they're like 17 a car, uh, 17 cards in each series, but still very interesting. Pop series four. This is the one that should be the most expensive, but I think I got a good deal on it, so it was it ended up being cheaper than that. Um, the evolutions one. I think the evolutions I overpaid. Um, I think it was because it had those Pokemon in it. <laughs> but um, in regards to contents. I think this one is the most expensive one. Should it, it has like the, you know the Gold Star, Umbreon, or Espeon? I think one of them. This was the last one I was chasing. By the way, I bought it from America because I couldn't find it in Australia. And then my friend just said, "Hey, there's one in Australia," but I already paid for this. So it was like too late. So I've been holding back on showing this. I've had every single one of these except that one until last week. So there is a rando and. Garchomp. All right, so that is nine. Really colorful, actually, when, when you put them together. That's really cool. Um, if I'm gonna say my favorite out of everything, um, it could be. Uh, I don't know if it's from the pops. It might be the Articuno from the Plasma Storm, but the pops are really cool too. You know, uh, who would I pick out of these? Probably. Uh oh, <laughs> Venusaur or that one? I think they look really cool too. Um, I think I paid 175 for that. Dang, that was like a rip. <laughs> a lot of these were like 10 bucks, 15 bucks, 12 bucks. Um, this was, I think, 150 dollars. So that's why, you know, I paid 175 for that. If uh, I can't really remember, but I think I paid. I know I paid a lot. So. Yeah, and then the next day I saw him, he had another one, the same seller, and he bumped it up like double that. I'm like, what? Kidding. Anyway, let's take a look at some of the cards in those sets, because I think it, they would be interesting. So, they're actually under Nintendo promos. Pop series. Uh, ooh, I want to see this. But it, I know it's not counted. Alright, well, that could be for another day. Pop series one. Mmm... Nothing too noticeable. Maybe that Tyranidar EX, you know. And like I said, 17 cards. This was in 2004. Okay, Pop Series 2, 17 cards. Yeah, pretty much right. Every year they looks like it was coming out. 2005, 
this one like they have decent Pokemon you know got the Entei the three dogs uh, the Bulbasaur Celebi EX would be the chase the psychic one I think someone was talking about this the other day um, all right got, just got a message <laughs> pop series 3 why did I pay so much for this one all right so it has the evolutions the Blastoise some decent pulls and uh oh EX yeah see that one I probably didn't need to pay that much for but like I said I was just chasing them and chasing them I had to get them from like different sellers nine different sellers that music looks really cool oh look at that from the trainer I think trainers are underrated sometimes I know you guys can't see it sorry let's do that oh that's cool that's different I like that all right PG, some starter, Squirtle, Wobbuffet, and we got Deoxys EX. So it looks like every single one has some, like one EX in them. So Pop Series 5, 17 cards. We got some Legendary. Oh, that's a Gold Star Mew, I believe. Or maybe not. No, it's not. <laughs> I've seen that Mew before there. Uh, got those Energies, the Charmander, Pikachu. There it is. Those are the two gold stars. Very, oh my god, 50,000? <laughs> TCG player. Wow. This is Espeon Gold Star. Very hard card to pull, hard to grade, uh, low pop. So, yeah. I think I saw someone selling this PSA 10 or PSA 9 for like 20k. Insane prices, guys. Espeon and Umbreon, also another popular one. I do see more of Umbreon gold sales than I do the Espeon, but yeah, that's pretty cool. Wow. Yeah, that definitely deserves, you know, Pop Series 5. I've seen some people open them to try to chase them. I'm just going to look at this Mew. All right, yeah, nothing. I thought it was the Gold Star. It looked like the Gold Star one, but it's not. All right, Pop Series 6. I think Pop Series 5 definitely has the most valuable out of these Turtwig this one doesn't even have any EX oh it has the no no it doesn't look like it all right that's interesting and they also had the levels on this one 2007 must be like diamond pearl era or something all right so they're keeping up with the levels Pop Series 7, nothing noticeable out of the last couple seem kind of dry. They don't seem very interesting at all. That Latios might be a hollow, but that doesn't entice me to get them. <laughs> That's probably why those packs are a little bit cheaper. I'm surprised that was harder to find as well for me, but it might be an Australia thing, you know, market smaller here. Uh, yeah, all right, so they might have a bit of a design thing here on the bottom, maybe a reverse of some sort, you know, the, the cracked ice on the card, it looks like it. All right, they're just experimenting. <laughs> and what do we have here? Garchomp, oop, screw that message, Pikachu, all right. Yeah, nothing, nothing too fabulous. <laughs> But yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, let me know your favorite art set. Um, not art set, sorry. Booster pack to enter the giveaway in the comment section. And make sure you like, subscribe, whatever is um, the standard. I'll do the random generator. Um, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time. This is up for grabs. Just a reminder, that's the, the prize. That's the prize for 1,000 subscribers. <laughs> see you guys. Bye. Boop.